Today we're going to use a 4 inch grinder and a reciprocating saw with a 9 inch blade to remove the extruded aluminum rub rail. We're also going to use a Festool CT mini vacuum with auto, manual and variable speed. The 5 inch orbital sander will be used to sand the whole hull. We'll be using 220 grit sandpaper for the whole job. Use Festool sandpaper, it works well and lasts a long time. Buy a box of 50 sheets, you'll need it. Next is our protective gear, and we do use it. This is a roll of 220 grit sticky back sandpaper for all the radius areas and tight spots you'll have to get at. These are the high density foam rollers and a handle for them. Next is the foam brushes. They're the key to the whole outcome. Go to a marine store and get the really stiff ones. Three inch ones work really well. Get a good quality tape because the cheap stuff leaves a residue that's very hard to get off and easy to paint over and you don't see it until you are all done with the job. Get a good squeegee too. This is a tube of putty for filling scratches and small divots. It dries fairly quick. This is a surfacing putty for deeper scratches and divots up to about an eighth of an inch deep. It also dries quite fast. This is for the larger damaged area that need more volume to fill. Mix it properly according to the directions. We use mostly Pettit paint because it covers well, looks great, and wears very well. We never thin this paint. This is what we're after. Nice shine and even color. Here we're cutting off the rub rail. Every bolt had to be cut off. Not fun. We also removed the old swim platform and removed the trim tabs. Fortunately the old rub rail bases can all be unbolted and removed easily. The deck to hull joint was also cleaned up and the sticky numbers were all removed. The hull is clean, taped off, and ready to be sanded. This is the first coat after it dried overnight, and you can see it looks great. This is the second coat after it dried overnight, and we also sealed up the hull and deck joint. The red, black, and white will look nice. All the window frames will also be painted gloss black. She's going to look very sharp. Well, that's all for this week. Questions and comments are always welcome. Thanks for watching.